I think primarily the idea of global health is a difficult one to communicate at the best of times. So just trying to get people to understand the range of topics that we address um, and the fact that we address it within a UNU context, which is a think tank rather than a university. Um, so it's, it's, it's a lot of nuance. There often aren't very clear, concise messages. Um, so that can be quite difficult. Um, the second challenge I would say for us, particularly here, is the lack of capacity. Um, so a lot of us are researchers. Um, and the idea of communicating and communicating to different audiences is also very difficult. So it's, and our, our constituents are policymakers, um, the academic community, um, and particularly for us here and the focus of our work, the community as well. So it's several levels of communication that we need to deal with. We have had some really good discussions around um, being able to um, act to being able to break up the ideas into bite-sized pieces that allow for that communication to happen. Um, there are also a range of different skills that we can use, um, different technologies that we can use that have made um, the the the. Um, communication of the nuance much easier, but I think for us as an institute, it gives us several uh, points around which we can have, an inter have internal discussions um, to talk about how we might address some of the, those communication challenges. Um, uh, one of the really nice things for me is knowing that we have the support across the um, UNU family, whether it's through the Office of Communications in Tokyo. I had no idea that Maastricht had um, such strong capacity in the area and was able to support our efforts, um, support the efforts across all the institutes. So they will be hearing a lot from us. Um, and and it wasn't, it's not just about the, the specific skills, but also the fact that we're doing a lot of things in common as well. So um, the being able to partner across institutes was really good. Um, one of the best things for me um, over the, the two days of the discussions um, is the, the importance of just picking up the importance of communications in our work. Um, and I've always been a very firm believer that the research that we do, particularly in global health, has to be communicated. It is absolutely of no value to anyone if it remains with the researchers. And I think even of less value in peer-reviewed journals if the, the expectation is that it is applied to make a real difference in population health.